Uh, we actually were, we was praying in the Linwood Mosque and we finished the first rakat and we are standing for the second rakat to do the second rakat prayer and um, we heard some uh, gunshots and at first I thought it was uh, somebody probably playing uh, firecrackers or something. Then I heard one of the brothers call, uh, some of the brothers got shot. And then I heard some more uh, shotguns and what I did, uh, then I ran to see where the shot uh, coming from. And when I ran there, there was a F-Post machine on the table. I just grabbed that one and ran outside. When I was running outside, I see two people was uh, already dead on the pathway. And I saw one man, so it's like, um, he had the whole army clothes on and uh, with balaclava and, um, and I was swearing at him and I said, who are you? And first I thought he was from the army or something. Then I saw he's tried to get the gun from the car and I threw that um, f boss machine on him. Then he got the gun out of his car and started shooting at me. He did around four or five um, shot on me. And I was able to duck myself between the cars and run when I was coming running in a, the, the mosque, like they had a car park way. I tried to run there, then I saw another dead body there and a shotgun next to it. That guy's because when he shot the other three people, I think so he was run out of bullets for that gun because it's like a shotgun, you cannot put too many bullets on it. He left that one, he tried to run to the car to get the second gun. I'll be honest with you, I didn't have any fear on me or anything. My only concern was to save other people people from there to doesn't get hurt. And I just left that gun and I see there was no bullet on it. When I pressed the, the uh, cage and there was no bullet on it. And I was screaming to the guy, come, I'm here, come, I'm here. I tried to put his focus on me. I didn't want him to go to the masjid inside the mosque. And what happened then, I heard gunfire from the inside the mosque. That time I know he's already inside the other mosque, inside our mosque as well. And I scream at him, oh, come on, I'm outside, come on, I'm outside. I was swearing at him and everything. Then I ran from the back and I had the shotgun in my hands. And then I saw him, he dropped the gun, he ran. He ran and I chased him. Uh, I, I chased him, he ran to his car and sat on his uh, driver's seat. When he sat on the driver's seat, I didn't know if he had another gun or there or things. He might get another gun to shoot me. And what I did, and that shotgun I had in my hands, I threw like an arrow on him and he bust his window. And that way he got shocked. He thought I'd probably shoot at him in something because all this window was blast. And he just gave his swear to me and just took off. And I chased him with that um, gun on the street, then because it was red light and he has to stop and what he did, he just come to the other line and just uh, turn right from the red line, red light, traffic lights and he ran away.